The Founding Fathers warned us about this. The Koch brothers figured this out a generation ago. The Supreme Court clearly understands this if you've watched the last couple weeks of horrific opinion after horrific opinion. Mitch McConnell totally understands this. That's why he protects this place more than any others. What do all these places have in common? They understand that the front line in the battle over democracy is on our state houses, not the federal government, in our state houses. And why is that? And we better all figure this out real quick and go to battle accordingly. Why state houses? Why are they the institution that all these folks are focused on as they try and subvert democracy and lock in their minority world viewpoint? Well, two things. One, they understand that from economics to tax policy to regulation and climate to privacy and road to education to guns to health care, state houses deal with almost every issue that anyone in this country cares about politically, including the issues that the right wing so prioritizes. And that's why you see an onslaught in state houses every day on these issues. But secondly, they understand that state houses have a unique power over democracy itself. They have unique powers to shape democracy. Who votes, when they vote, how they vote, how they register, how they can be knocked off the rolls. Can they use drop boxes or not? State houses determine that. They also are the ones who draw the district lines. So they can either draw a robust democracy where people have a choice, or they can rig democracy by gerrymandering. They also have a say, obviously, in the electoral college process. So with, with the power they have over issues and with the power they have over democracy themselves, state houses turn out to be the place that if you want to attack democracy, it's the best place to do it. And they're doing it every single day, every single year, and they've done it for decades. It's all coming clear more and more in recent weeks, in recent years. And it's right why I wrote my book, to wake people up about it. If we're gonna fight this, folks, we have to reorient our politics. Yes, we gotta win federal seats, it's critical this year, but we also have to go back to where the attack is happening at the state level, at the state house level. Get in there, folks. Get in at the state house level and help in any way that you can.